everyone, welcome back to Engineering Stories. Today I'll be talking about my experiences from first year against my experiences from second year. And yeah, let's get started. For my first year experience, it was really nice getting to meet so many different people. It was every single day I was meeting somebody new and that hasn't stopped even in second year. I would say the hardest part about it is just the academic portion about engineering, it's really tough. It's a lot of work and you're gonna feel like you're gonna be behind, but I promise you, take a be there. Just ask your professor if you are having any doubts. And also group study, that's what helped me a lot was just studying with my friends and also getting food on campus is really nice. I recommend these places that I will link below. I made a video about um, food on campus as well. And first year, I think my favorite part was the social aspect. I got to attend a lot of events. I got to be on council. It was overall really great. So really join design teams and go to events and just have fun because it's your first year. And the academics, it's gonna be tough, but as long as you're on top of it, you'll be fine. Something that I loved about second year is that my classroom sizes are way smaller. So in first year, English or physics or math were huge. There were a couple hundred people in my classroom and it was always very intimidating. But in second year, you are just with people who are very like-minded. And because you guys are in the same specialization, everyone sort of knows each other. And it was about class sizes of um, at most 80 and it can also shrink to about 30. So it was really nice that you get to kind of see everybody um, consistently every single day, and it was great. All right, and for the next question is course load. How different is a course load? Um, about the number of courses you're gonna be taking from first to second, it's gonna be around the same, so five to six a month. And in second year, it's gonna be more specialized. So for me, being in biomedical engineering, I had a course dedicated to biology. And then I had another course where it was more lab-based, but using biomedical technology. And that's because it's tailored to my specialization, and it's gonna be different for each of the 14 specializations that we have at UBC. And one thing I really enjoyed in second year was the hands-on experience. We got to do a cadaver lab in the medical building right away in second year biomed course. And we also got to do a lot of uh, product-based design. So my group did a device that would help increase adherence for kids with cystic fibrosis and it was really really fun. Is second year harder than first year? And I think that one really differs from person to person but I think that second year is that you're expected to do better and it's just more of a level up than first year. I would not say it's that much harder, but it is just that you gotta put more effort in. A lot of people say they've enjoyed second year more. A lot of people say it's been super hard, but either way, you just gotta find a good rhythm and a good sleep schedule, and then you'll be fine. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, before I end up the video, I wanna give some advice to let you guys know that whether you're choosing your specialization or if you're just coming into first year, pick it day by day and pick what you really like. If in first year you're picking your specialization, let me reflect back and see which one you really enjoy in particular for the courses and for first year for just coming in. Don't be sad or afraid if you are falling behind because it's so normal. You are starting your first year, it's normal to be behind. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.